my follow-up video on Amy Klobuchar withdrawal from the VP consideration. So there is a tweet from a high-profile blue check person. So I'm just going to read it. As someone who built a platform campaigning for representation, I never thought I would say this, but representation is now often being used to distract people from the actual needed change in upholding systematic white supremacy. This is a slander, a big slander to women of color who are being considered as VP. If you want progressive change in this country, Progressive change comes from representation, representation of who can deliver on policies. And we all know who is delivering and has been delivering since the coronavirus. Senator Kamala Harris came up with numerous bills, and that includes Vote Saved Act. That includes Save Our Streets with Ayanna Presley. That includes the bill with the progressive king of lords of lords, Bernie Sanders, and the most progressive male in the Senate, which is Ed Murky, with the 2000 odds towards each family up until March 2021, and even extended three months after that. So, I mean, representation has become a distract people. It's disingenuous. It's fucking disrespectful. And this is coming from a black man who's supposed to be about representation. Those who are still capping for Warren to be VP, and I understand you guys want her. We all don't want the same person. But if she was very progressive, she would drop out. She would actually withdrew her name, excuse me, from consideration and let the black woman who is her friend advance. So for those who still want to come for me because I support Kamala Harris, bring it. Because I'm here. You could drop in the comments. You could say whatever. Because I'm going to come back with something else. So I'm ready and prepared. So let's do it. Bring it.